Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. So today I want to talk about a new free-to-play, play-to-earn game on the Rotting blockchain. Now, if you know Rotting blockchain, they are known by X Infinity and now Pixels. So it's a very cool, with very exciting games on this blockchain. And this game is called Wild Forest. So this game is a strategic game where you have to get your NFTs, create your battle deck, and then you're going to be able to create your arm from that NFTs and attack the enemy. So it's a really cool game. But if you want to get into this game, you need to go and get it today. Because they have a promotion where if you win for 10 days, 3 missions every day, you're going to get a battle pass completely free. And with this battle pass, you're going to be getting not only free NFTs, but also free tokens. So that is really cool. Now, this game is available for iOS and Android, and I'm going to show you the game soon. But if you are interested, just come and visit the website. Uh, there is a lot of details here. I'm going to show you the white paper later as well. But this is pretty much how the game works, and it's a very cool game. I am quite addicted to this game, to be honest. My partner is also playing all the time. You can see here some of the different NFTs that you can get it some of the different rarities of the NFT. It also talks about this battle pass. So as you can see, you have to win three times a day for 10 days. It doesn't need to be 10 days in a row. However, this promotion is ending 11 days. So you need to get started today. And even then, you're just going to be able to miss one of these days to get your battle pass. And this will assure that you're going to get a lot of NFTs and a lot of tokens. Now, they also have a leaderboard that depending on how you hang on the leaderboard, you're also going to get some prizes. And the leaderboard, I think there's prize for all the way from 1,000 players. So that is really cool. So there is some FAQs here and some details about the team as well. So please come and check it out if you're interested. Now, you can also see this is the NFTs I got playing the game. So I have been playing the game for a few days now. I got these NFTs. Now, these NFTs are on the testnet. It's my understand that they're going to migrate these NFTs to the mainnet. You can see here, if I go to the mainnet, I don't have NFTs now. You can see some people with NFTs on the mainnet. They come from the packs. So if you bought a pack, you can get your NFT here. You would get a lord. You would get some skins. However, I don't have any packs. So all my NFTs are coming from the testnet. You can update your NFT and you can also merge your NFT for a better variety. So you can come and check like the white paper. There is all the details you need to know. And if you can't find it, there is not on the website. Uh, the best way to do is go to their website, join the Discord, and here on Discord, you're gonna be able to find a, a white paper. And you can also find the Substack where you can get a lot of other information. So if you bought the pack, or if you're interested in buying the pack, you can get the Lords. And then you can see here, you can get, depending on the rarity of your lord, you can get the chateau, the tower, the castle, and the citadel. Uh, this will allow you to train your units, to recruit uh, NFTs, and also to buy NFTs from gold. So gold is one of the tokens of the game, and they also use a second token to also help you or allow you to merge your NFTs into higher rarities. So this is an infographic showing how the game actually works. So you play the game, you win games, uh, you get your battle pass. So if you have the battle pass, this is what you're going to get. You're going to get better units, you're going to get skins, and you're going to get the WF token. If you play on the free, you're going to get NFTs, you're going to get skins, you're going to get the shards, and you're going to get the gold. Now, the gold is used here to level up your characters. So you need gold and shards to level up, and then you need the token WF and also the NFTs to merge. So you can see here, you can merge two commons into one uncommon using two commons and one WF, or you can merge two uncommons uh, with two WF tokens into one rare and so on all the way to a legendary. So also when you win the game, you're going to increase your league rating and also your leaderboard. And here you can see on the leaderboard, you're going to get rewarded with uh, different prizes. Now, another way is you can get your units. You can apply skins to the units to make it look different and nicer on the game. You can also go and trade them on Mavs Marketplace. Now, you cannot do that at the moment because NFTs are on the testnet. But as soon as they get transferred to the mainnet, you should be able 
to go ahead and sell them. So I just want to highlight a little bit more about the team. So Zillion Wales are the team behind it and they have some cool games here. As you can see, they got some awards and they have other games that are not NFT related or not crypto related. That looks quite cool as well. So this one's available for iOS, Android, Steam, PS4, Xbox, and Switch as well. So that's showing the team has real experience uh, building different games. Now, I just want to quickly show the marketplace. So if you go to Mavis Market, you can see there is the Lords at the moment. So the floor price is 100 runnings. There is the packs that you can buy. There is also the different units and also the skins. So you can see here how much a unit that you can on the game would be valued at. So if you get one of my NFTs, so let's get this one that is the most valuable I have. So that's a ninja. So if I put here ninja, and then if we filter it by rarity, so I have a rare one, and then you can see it's going for about $18. So when I get that to my main ad, uh, I already got $18 for this NFT. And also there are other NFTs that I received playing the game. As you can see here, I already have 10 NFTs where I got one rare, four uncommons and the other ones are common. So that is really cool. Now let me go and show you the game a little bit. So if I swap here for the game, as you can see, I have here on the top of the trophy road. So those are the price that I already collect. You can see here, I have few prize that I have collected. I have shards, I have coins, and I have this chest that I already opened and inside them, I could have shards, it could have coins, it could have NFTs. Now also there is the battle pass here. You can see at the bottom, uh, I'm already over halfway through my tasks. So also similar here, however, you have some better chests here with better contents inside. Now the way you get points here is to doing these tasks. So you need to go look the tasks you have to do and then you have to complete them. So for example, here I have to build nine mines. So that is quite a bit of mines I have to build. Uh, I could also capture 10 enemy territories. So that's pretty much what I need to do to get the points. And this will come here and more points I get it, more I can unlock through this road. You're gonna go and receive the ones on the bottom right now but you're gonna get the ones on the top just after you get your premium. And here you can see there's a button showing get free and that shows that I have to win uh, three games every day for 10 days. And so for me here is still three days left. And as you can see, there is only 10 days and 19 hours to do so. So go ahead, download the game and start playing now. It's not difficult. It takes about 10 minutes to get three wins. However, as more you progress the battles start to get a little bit more complicated and may take a bit more time. However, it's quite fun to play anyway. So the other part I want to show you is the cards. So here you can see all my cards. You can see how I put my uh, battle deck. Uh, I don't have any tier three. Uh, so I select three of tier one. I select three of tier two here that I've been using to play. Now if I go and click battle, I can go ahead and create a battle. It's gonna find another opponent that's connected to play with me and then I have to go ahead and try to win the game at the same time I try to do the missions that I have to do to win the points. So the game is pretty easy you just move your character to the area it's gonna claim the area I can also beat build barracks mines or towers so that the mines give me more of this power here on the corner to build other things and also to get uh, some of my troops. Uh, as you can see, I need 15 mana to get, uh, as you can see, I need five mana to have this first character. I need 13 mana to get the first of tier two and so on. Now I can go ahead and build another barrack so I can build more units because as I build these barracks, uh, they take a while to build another uh, player. So you can see that he already way in front of me because I've been talking here with you, trying to explain what's going on. So he's already way in front of me. But let's go ahead and see how one of the towers would look like. You can also get up the level. So you can see the barracks at the moment, I can just build unit level one. If I increase the level, I'm going to be able to get units level two. You can see here he has a wolf. That's a unit level two. 
I can do the same with my tower, get level two, and I can start to get my level two troops uh, to fight here with him. So let's go ahead and see if I can recover for this. Now he got a tier three here that I probably won't be able to kill him anymore. So I think that's a game over for me at the moment. Now I know he's gonna win. I can uh, keep playing a little bit more to get extra points for the tasks that I need to do uh, to get more points or I can just go and quick the game. So I just click here and hold and that will exit the game for me. Cool, so now this is Wild Forest. I hope you guys enjoy. Like if you wanna get your free Battle Pass, start playing it today. I hope you enjoyed this game as well and I'll see you on the next one. Bye now.